Hey everybody, welcome back to Fallout 4. This is Lance B Gaming, and we're at Finch Farm. We're doing the tour here at Finch, or well, I like to call Finch and Sons. Nice little throwback to one of my favorite shows, Sanford and Sons. And uh, people are talking. Um, and my lights are now for the Finch and Sons. Great. Anyway, but um, that's normally lit right there, Finch and Sons. This is since the father likes to collect junk at this location. Well, where you the lights at? And so I built on top of this mountain of crap he's accumulated. And the name of this is Junk in the Box, Thrift and Salvage. So I thought this is actually perfect for this hot mess right here that we have to look at. And I have the scrapping station where the father uses to get scrap from right near all this. So I thought this is it kind of goes with the theme. And the care of it what are people freaking out about? I don't see nothing. I see something up there on my radar. That's all the way up there. Anyway, um, that Doc Anderson and his little caravaners usually stay around here, so I don't move that. I've made some um, changes in this uh, settlement. Let's see here. So this is when you first came in originally. This is where the family lived was in here. Now this is where the caravan depot is. And we have our, I have the oldest son as the herbalist. I took out that whole garden out altogether. Since they do salvage here now, we have a couple cows for food. So here's the mother. She sure makes for a full day. Oh, I bet so. I bet so. Uh, she's our barkeep here. I got a little chef hat on her for a nice little touch. The only thing I could come up with was this vault tech. Welcome to Finch Farm or Finch Junkyard. Take your pick. Oh, thank you. Very kind. And so I have a vault tech lab coat on her. Temporarily. I have to figure out what I'm going to put her in and be more suitable for her. like a barkeep. And they have their little, you know, eating area around here. And of course, this is the caravanners pick up and drop off area. And of course, as you've seen this at my Grey Garden house, player home. I love that. The walls already come pre decorated. Love that little touch. And I put a little meat hook and butcher area and the diner booths my favorite thing up in every salon and then we you can do laundry here the laundry area you can turn all your dirty stuff into clean stuff which is nice and here's the caravaners check check-in area and we wrap around here just like a uh, Grey Garden, you can go up here and you can build up there if you like. <coughs> Pardon me, I'm so sorry. Still trying to get all that crap out of my chest with this chest cold. It does not want to go away. I know a lot of other people have been getting sick this summer too. It defeats the purpose to me, I think summertime you should be pretty healthy but anyway um, where should we start with so what I did was I want to utilize as much space as possible over here so if you come behind and go into the building there's a ramp and here's some living quarters around here so we have the parents here 
Mom and Daddy Finch live and have their bed in here. Really no privacy to, you know, make babies. Kind of old for that. But they have a little sitting area, a little radio if they want. Um, and a little sleeper sofa here. And, uh, some more sleeping area. And then you come up here. This is more of the. We have the beacon here for the other cell phones. For emergency. We have a guard post right here. We also believe in solar being green, so here's some solar handling. Our radar. Our finch form. What does this say? Finch form sky settlement. Live at a higher level. Of the junkyard. <laughs> now renting overpass property, a secure location, great views, reasonable rates. That's cute. Um, I don't have any property up there, but okay. Just in case I did, that sign already has it. So, a nice little overlook area. You can see what's going on around these parts. If you're up here, you can see pretty far. I like that. And of course, if you go str look straight ahead, oh, I see. Oh, 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 I see some red diamonds over here. Gunners are always over in this area right here because there's sawgrass. And there's the gunners. There's always gunners right there want to start some ish. Sometimes you gotta. Attack them first and nip that shit in the bud. Those, those rock bastards. We have a gauss back here. Turret. Now we're come over here. And Mr. Cow is supposed to be in here because this is the cow's quarters right here. So we put the cows in, in the, or the Brahmin. If you want to be technical about it. The Brahmins stay here. This is, I mean, look at this. The Brahmin have... I made sure they had some place nice to stay. I mean, shoot. They... What? Son of a bitch! Open the door! God damn, both... <sighs> get the hell out of my way. That's for you not to get the hell out of my way. Punch you, though. Vagina. Robot vagina. Anyway. We got some hub flowers right here. They just drive me crazy. I'm sorry. I'm not a violent person. But God. Pickles. And this is why I want to decorate this more. I think I ran out of building space here. But maybe if I go to uh, get uh, more building space if I... Uh, clear out that overpass right there and give me some more of my bill window because this is why I put the older brother you know he's old enough he needs his own place maybe bring a lady back since the, uh, the younger brother screwed up and tried to hook up with some raiders you know the older brother gets this he gets his own place not decorated, but you know. he gets his own bathroom. I mean, nice little view, sink, toilet. Look, I love the shot. Look at that. Such a nice, just so cool. I love that. It takes so little for me to be so impressed with something. But here's some extra people want to crash here they can they got a nice little is that sleeper somewhere no just airplane seats and some more sleeping area decant decontamination arch I can never say that But yeah, 
This is my Finch Farm. I really enjoyed this build too. It's, it was kind of cool. It was, it was different. I, I, I would like to uh, just add more detail in not Jake, but the other brothers, uh, older brothers place right here. Maybe like a little kitchen, at, kitchen area or something. More of a lived in feel. But other than that, everything turned out to be good. the caravan cargo area. Um, I love how that turned out. I was able to put quite a bit of detail in here. And, uh, oh god, that radio. And, <laughs> and I like how I work around this instead of delete, uh, scrapping everything. Um, I thought it worked great if, his, if you know, one of our settlements needs to be like a scrapyard area. So, why not Finch Farm and work around it? And uh, just to kind of make a detail about like these little canopy area right here. Almost look like a used car lot. <laughs> a building for an old used car lot. But, uh, but yeah. I wish it wasn't so damn dark though. I have to do this build. I have to do this tour during the night time. But yeah, that's. I need to get that fixed. Finch and Sons. I thought that was a nice little touch. 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 I need to enunciate like John McLean. McLean, whatever his name was. But anyway. I hope you enjoyed the Selma build. I enjoyed showing it to you. And uh, I have some more coming up soon. And see y'all later.